we're back in code fights and we have a very special presidential edition of algorithm where we're going to add that border we're going to build a wall today a uh, little joke don't no one take it too seriously anyhow <laughs> um so what we're what the task is is we get an array of strings that all have the same length what, what we're tasked with is to build a border around it and so the end has to go all the way across and then it has to have enough for pieces to go along the sides of the strings. The way that I do it is I first go ahead and I create that wall and I then just concat the string values after pushing, unshifting and pushing those values to the array. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I, uh, you don't need to create a variable, but I do. Uh, just to kind of put the Put the uh, put it in context, and we're going to call this length of the wall. And we're just going to set it equal to these the length of the very first string. Again, they're all the same size, so it doesn't matter. And then we're going to add two to it because we have to have one for the end and one for this. For instance, this is three, right? So we need five spaces. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to create a wall variable. And the, really, the only the only point of this is to concat the asterisk onto the wall to go ahead and have the wall set up for the first value and the last value, the big wall, the, both of the two longest walls. And we're going to just go ahead and iterate through. I'm going to say var i is equal to zero, but i is less than the length of the wall, i plus plus, and then we're going to take wall, set equal to wall dot concat, and all we're concatting is our asterisk. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and just return it. Make sure everything is working as anticipated, right? So we should get in this first test a wall that is the length of five asterisks. Exactly. Cool. Now that we have that, we can go ahead and unshift and push it. Unshift will go ahead and add that to our picture. And what? let's go ahead and put picture here so that we can see it. And we'll go ahead and put picture dot unshift that wall and then picture dot push that wall and we'll run our code and you'll see here we have our first wall we have our second wall but now we need our side we need our side walls our side pieces side chicks as i would say if my girlfriend was awake to to mess with her she doesn't think it's funny i think it's hilarious <laughs> All right, so because we are iterating, because we're only, our next for loop is only on the, the not the beginning and the end wall, we're gonna start our for loop off at one and not zero, because we don't need to add on to that first wall. And then we also are gonna end it early for the length of the array, instead of doing just picture.length, it's actually picture.length minus one, because we don't need to do it on our last wall. She's gonna hate it if she sees this video on the internet and I made a side chick joke. She's gonna absolutely hate me for that. Uh, so, <laughs> uh, so all we're gonna do here is we're gonna replace the picture there, and we're gonna say, hey, go ahead and concat our ast an asterisk. So we have our starting asterisk, and then we have our ending, uh, our concat, which is going to be the original value. Um, and our uh, closing asterisk as well. So uh, the value is in there, ABC, we're gonna, in front of it, put an asterisk, and then behind it, put an asterisk, and then we run our test. Submit, we're good to go. So that was add border, uh, not too bad. I, th I actually, for some reason, uh, so I had to refactor a bunch of my code um, I had about twice the amount of code here when I originally did this. Some of it was, I, I think I was doing this late night when I was tired and you kind of get loopy. Um, but uh, pro probably looking at it now, uh, not too bad of a, a problem to get going here. But as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. And if you'd, if you'd like to join our Facebook group, support me on Patreon, or join the Discord channel, all those links are in the description below. I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. Special thanks to our sponsors, Dev Mountain. If you're looking for a coding boot camp where tuition and housing is included, definitely check them out. Appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video.